Hello. You've joined me for part seven, you lucky guys. We're again in this store today. There's a big number three on it. I should probably explain those numbers and the number of stars that you need to go through for doors. Uh, because we have 24 stars, it's not really an issue for us. Also, Team Nintendo. I keep saying Nintendo Box. Team Nin Play Box's first year anniversary coming up. That's tomorrow. Or the 9th, if this video isn't uploaded today. And also, this part is going to be pretty fun because we're going to go on to Jolly Roger Bay. And I remember as a little kid, I used to hate Jolly Roger Bay, so I never used to play it. Since I've started playing Super Mario 64 properly, I've only just got the hang of all the levels, so <laughs> I may get a bit confused in this part. This is a, one of the secret stars. It's just like collecting a Nivea 8 red coins in any other world, apart from this one's underwater. Maybe I should explain a bit about swimming underwater as well. Swimming underwater, to swim faster, you need to tap A at a certain point. You'll also lose health the longer you spend underwater. You can collect coins. They will heal you. Also, if you're near the top of um, some water, and you're sort of just floating on the top, that restores all your power. So that's a quick start on for you. plan is, for the next few parts, if you want to see me defeat Bowser, that won't be for a while yet. We're just going to do Jolly Roger Bay, and then I think that's all we can do. Uh, we don't want to go back in there again. That's all we can do down here. So then we'll go straight to Bowser, and then we'll explore the basement for a bit. I'm seeing Plunder in the sunken ship, this one's called. If you see what I mean about um, floating to the top, see that my power is going down, it would go to green mm, soon. <laughs> go green. I actually want my power. There we go. If I swim to the top, it heals me. It's rather nice. Down here is the sunken ship. As you can see, there is a big eel in the way. We need to get through there. So I think what you need to do Let's just swim back up to the top again. And go back down, and hopefully the eel should now be swimming around. Which is good, that's working. Right. Now we can go through the gap. And this is where the fun starts, because I can't remember the order of the treasure chests. There are four treasure chests. You're meant to open. I think it's the back one first. Then it's this one on the left. That one. I'm not pressing anything, you just nudge it. Quickly, my top tip, swim right to the top as fast as you can. Because uh, if you leave it too late, then... You'll have to go right back down from the bottom. Stars in the box. Number 26. I think this is um, the world where there's only 104 yellow coins, which is pretty tough. I think this is actually probably the toughest one to get the 100 coins on. Won't do it just yet though. You 
can see the ships now um, floating up to the top. And the eel is now in this bit. We've got to make him come out of his... Oh my god, he's going to eat me. <laughs> Hang on, let me get some health. Save some for later. Why are you, Mr. Eel? Oh, you're back in there again. Go away. No, I mean, come out. I should have done how to do this. Come, mate. Oh, I've died. What? No. You can't die on me. I never die. I've told you I'm not brilliant at this. Let's try again. I've just got to warn you that water levels aren't my favourite. Right, now I know how to get the eel out. I know not to touch the eel as well. <laughs> That's bad. Go on then. Out you come. Out you come. Come on before I die. I'm going to die again. I've died again. Someone else do this level for me. Can't believe that. Let's try again. Alright, let's get some health before I do anything else. Just a couple of coins. You come out. Come on, that's it, that's it. Don't get too close. Are you out? Yay! I've got it. About time. 27. 